Hi, this is Donnie Coons from the Horny Lions Club. I've been a member for 49 years and an original charter member. Next year, we're going to celebrate our 50th charter night. The VFW really helped us, and uh, we, we use their pavilion down there. We have our meetings down there if we want to, and uh, they, they've really been really great to us. We have bingo. We, we play bingo every year, and we help the fire company serve dinners in at in at their, in at their in at their fire company where they serve dinners every night. Plus, we just help keep the carnival going. And uh, everybody loves the food and horny. That's why they come to God's country to eat. Hi, my name is Tandy Cox with the Brunswick Alliance Club. I've been a member of this wonderful group for 30 years. In our community, we work with the Brunswick Legion and we prepare care packages twice a year. Uh, we also are heavily involved in the Brunswick Ecumenical Assistance Committee on these, known as Beacon, and through them we participate in the school supply drive and we also um, participate in the Christmas program that's providing gifts for needy children in our community. We provide eyeglasses for those uh, who can't afford them. And one of our most fun things to do is every year we sponsor a fishing derby for kids. And uh, we range from 80 kids in the spring to 100 kids. It's a family event, it's free, uh, and it's always a great thing that we do. And then there's blessings in a backpack, and that's providing uh, financial assistance uh, that backpacks with food and supplies can go to the kids that are needy in our neighborhood. So we are a very small club, but we have a great heart, and we're just very proud to be Lions. Hi, this is Chris Benson from the Sharpsburg Lions Club. I've been a Lion for over seven years, and I'm currently serving as the club secretary. At Sharpsburg, we offer several community services and unique fundraisers throughout the year. Our club has a medical equipment lending closet, and we collect hundreds of used eyeglasses for the recycling program. In the spring and fall, we hold our country ham sandwich sale, and the proceeds of these fundraisers go directly back to the Sharpsburg community. We help support the Sharpsburg area EMS and the volunteer fire department, to name a few. We also host several dinner programs during the year. These programs bring in local historians to talk about the unique history of the area and allow other local organizations to educate how they support the local community. Our club is especially proud of our dinner programs. They provide an opportunity to join in fellowship and educate the community about lionism while we learn about the local history and area services, all while enjoying a great home cooked meal. On behalf of the Myersville Lions Club, I want to thank the Wolfsville, Myersville, and Middletown communities for continuously supporting the Myersville Lions Club. How do you support us? It's very simple. You come out to our breakfast. You donate glasses and medical appliances and other resources. You donate foodstuffs. You donate money. You give of yourself to us. And we're able to take those resources and transfer them to people who are in desperate need right here in the Valley. We thank you again for coming out and supporting us. We thank you for eating our bacon. Every meal that we serve is an opportunity for us to take those mon monies, all of which we use in our local community. And if you'd like to join a team, a family of people who love taking care of other people in our hometowns, then you need to come out and join the Myersville Lions Club. It's a family like no other. And hey, your first meal is always on us. And it might be bacon. Thank you. Have a great day. Hi, my name is Howie Conway, and I've been a member of the Boonesboro Lions Club since July of 23. I really enjoy being part of this group and the wonderful work that they do in our community, such as visiting Charlotte's Home, our local assisted living facility here in Boonesboro every month and we celebrate the birthdays for the month with cake and ice cream and presents. And if there's no birthdays, then we play bingo with the residents and give out prizes, and they really love that. Um, I also love being the liaison between the schools and the club. 
Uh, this year we were able to purchase books for all of the local elementary school kindergarten classes to promote literacy and encourage student reading. And we also help out with the local food bank and Micah's backpack in providing students in need with bags of food that they take home uh, over the weekend when they don't have the school meals as a resource. Um, I hope to continue with this group for a long time and join the rest of the members of the Boonesboro Lions Club in serving our community. Hello, my name is Gary Bennett. I'm a member of the FSK Lions Club of Frederick. We're a small but mighty club. We have about 20 members. Um, we have many programs that we're very proud of. We have a medical equipment lending program. We do eye screenings. We provide food to our local food bank. We serve dinner at uh, our community table. And uh, we also play bingo with uh, Montevue Nursing Home and we sponsor a, a Frederick Little League uh, baseball club. So we do a lot of things. But the one thing I wanted to mention today that we're really proud of is an event we call Canines on the Creek. Canines on, Canines on the Creek is a um, doggy Halloween costume contest and parade for both the doggies and the owners. It's held the Saturday before Halloween on beautiful Carroll Creek in downtown Frederick. It's a wonderful project for us. It really hits the sweet spot of three different things. It's a uh, fundraiser for us. It's also a, a fundraiser for Leader Dogs for the Blind, so it's a service project. And finally, it's outreach to the community of Frederick. It's really our gift to the community of Frederick. There's nothing else like it around. It's really a blast. We have all kinds of vendors up and down Carroll Creek, uh, doggy related vendors like groomers and trainers and retail stores, veterinarians. Um, the owners and the dogs pay us a little fee to participate in the parade and we have hundreds and hundreds of spectators who really get a kick out of it. So that's just one example of something you can do if you join up with the Lions Club. We have a lot of fun and we do a lot of good for the community.